Hi guys, welcome to Live with Vi and if you like what you see, subscribe. Hi guys, happy Wednesday and welcome to Live with Vi. I am too excited today because uh, it's 11-11-2020. This year and this date has come only once before which is 11-11-1919. So today is a very, very powerful um, and a magical day. Uh, the reason why is because uh, there are a lot of energy that come into play. Um, if you if you talk about angel numbers or if you talk about spirituality, uh, 11, 11 is um, 11. When you see the sign 11, 11 or 111, um, it is a sign of spiritual awakening. It is um, a sign from the universe that it's time for you to wake up and be aware of your path. Um, so that is why today's day is very uh, magical and very important especially in the time that we are living in you know this pandemic has if it's not taught you anything else it's really taught you uh, about connecting with yourself and being um, becoming aware of what you want and you know what you like what you want to do uh, and i think it is amazing uh, that we have this opportunity to talk about it on this platform. Uh, I can't wait for Ashish to come on and um, you know show us what magic he's gonna do with us but like I said it's a very significant day today. Um, I hope you guys have meditated. I hope you guys have uh, tried to manifest things. I hope you guys have written your gratitude journals. Today whatever you do kind of um, you know is, is multiplied um, and tenfold or rather elevenfold should I say. Um, it's a very, very strong and powerful day. The energy kind of continues into the week. We have Diwali also coming, uh, which is obviously Lakshmi, which is Maha Lakshmi, which is abundance. So it teaches us about, you know, manifesting. It teaches us about uh, increasing your abundance. There are a lot of things that you can do. There are a lot of meditations that you can do. We just did one with Tamanna at 7 o'clock, which was... Uh, Tell, you know, it kind of connected you with your soul self, with your center self. And in times like this, you need that more than anything. You know, with, with we've, we're living in times which we've never experienced before. And uh, any, like I was reading the other day that, you know, you have so many storms and so many things. Someone tells you one day is magical in this year, you will grab it, you know. So it is supposed to be the luckiest day of the year. In fact, the luckiest day of the century. And that's how... Um, that's how the stars are aligned um, for us to kind of you know recognize ourselves and be more woke if i want to use the millennial term uh, and it gives us the the energy around gives us the chance to do that so if you guys have your crystals with you if you guys have your wands with you you know it's a great time uh, to put them out tonight um it is um a, what we, we're going to do the meditation now but um, if you have the chance do the meditation again at 11 11 at night that is 11 11 pm i hope you guys got uh, to do something at 11 11 uh, am in the morning i am just waiting for dr ashish to come on let me just uh, there he is and i know i can't stop gushing about this new insta live thing i love it i can actually see everyone's uh, messages clearly without i'm talking to their face being covered um uh, so like I was saying, we're going to talk today, um, I want to talk about uh, with Dr. Ashi about why this day is so magical, what we can manifest, how we can manifest and I even want to talk about what we can do for Dhanteras and um, because he is the king of money, you know, money flow and money abundance. So I want to, I want to, you know, ask him to give us some tips for Dhanteras. He gave us a fabulous tip about um the rice and the lemon. I don't know how many of you guys have seen it or heard our live or, or you know, logged on and watched it on IGTV. But it is such an amazing uh, trick to kind of clear out the energy uh, from your house. So I want to know what he has in store for Dhanteras because, like I said, it's it's a re it's, Dhanteras has come in such a powerful time with eleven eleven. There he is. You just have to accept my request. Oh, he's unable to join. I wonder why. Maybe he's sending me a request. Hi, 
I have sent you the request. Yeah. Hello. Hello. And we are back. <laughs> we are back. Happy 11-11. <laughs> oh my God. It's so, so amazing. Isn't How are it? you guys? How are you? I'm very good. How are you? Good, good, good. Super. You know how I've been. Huh? This whole month I is know. so magical and everything is so magical this time. And the whole Kedarnath. Oh my God. I'm still in that whole vi high vibrational energy. <laughs> and then 11, 11 had to come this time. So it's like so amazing. And that's what I said. I was like, we have to talk today. There's no chance we can't. We have to. We have to talk about magic. Yeah, I'm yeah, telling you, I'm so know. excited since morning. Kunal said, like, calm down. What is wrong with you? I'm like, no, no, no. 11, 11, 20, 20. After 100 years, it's coming. Like, what exactly. I want to do? Exactly, exactly. I mean, you know, we we very lucky. We are all very, very lucky to be Absolutely. in this time and to witness this and be a part of it. And of course, you know, those people who are coming online and those people who are wanting to know about these things. I mean, I, I'm saying we are blessed, and that's what you know, consciousness is all about. You know, only conscious people will understand these things, and it's amazing that we can do this together. Thanks to you also. I I always say na. I, I was telling Tamanna just before we had a seven o'clock meeting. Okay. I was like, it is so amazing. I can talk about this on an open Correct. platform. You know, like I you you and me both, right? I mean, you still talk about it because obviously through class and all. I have never spoken about this part of my life. You yeah. Know, because yeah. I just thought people were not interested. And it's already 96 followers. So, you know, people <laughs> want to know and people are interested. And people, I think now more than any yeah. time in the world, people want to want to learn and want to become aware of what's happening Correct. just with them. Right? Correct. You know, I, I love it when people show this interest and, you know, when they come and learn and then their life changes. And believe me, every day, I'm not kidding, every day I either wake up or during the day I have this testimonials coming and it's always gratitude to me. I'm like, no, thank yourself because you chose it, you know, yeah, you didn't think like, yeah. And that's the beauty of it, how they're changing their life and how they're making changes in other people's life. And that's the beauty of it, you know. And yeah, I'm just loving it so much. And I'm telling every day, you know, how many messages I get and I forward them to you. <laughs> awesome, awesome. So tell me, what did you do and how's your 11 coming in? My 11 was fabulous. I just launched my evil eye clothing <laughs> way. I, I, <laughs> and that was so I'm, cheeky of you to I'm, send I'm me your obsession it. with evil eye. I'm but but it, it. it's, it's gorgeous. I, I love Thank it. You. The dress also Thank that you, you made looks so, so beautiful. I Thank mean, you, you make it look beautiful. Trust me when I say that. And <laughs> <laughs> so I keep showing Rahul. I said, isn't she so gorgeous? She's so beautiful. <laughs> but I'm just so, one another one is watching. I was thinking, on our, and now to, you, you know the new Insta Live, right? We can see ourselves yeah. without any, any messages and all coming on our faces. Oh, really? So see how do you read the messages? Oh, my, not on faces, so, okay. Otherwise, when the message is to come, it should come on your face, right? Okay, now it's okay, all down, okay. so we can clearly oh, okay. see our faces because we're only looking at ourselves. Huh? <laughs> no, no. I know. I, I wish, I, you know, honestly, I wish I could see See, see the number of calls. Oh, one, one, one. We just became one, one, four. Yeah. You know, I, I just wish I could see everybody who is there because I'm a very visual person. I love I seeing people. I love meeting people. I love hugging people, you know, but yeah, virtually I know everybody's there and I'm so grateful that they show up and you were like you know should we do it at eight o'clock should we not it's dinner time i'm like after eight every time it's dinner time only some I agree. At nine or whatever but yeah i mean those people who are plugging in i'm so grateful you are here right now and let's let's do this i, I, so I actually to share. have an idea for you for december which i really want to do i want to do wow. me and you 100 okay. people zoom and just uh, talk like we just have a conversation of me and you talk that's it. I want. I want to do that. I want to do uh, or uh, hapo no hapo no hundred people. I always say zoom. it takes hundred hundred people together. Yeah, when you put an intention, it gets created like that. That's how my Absolutely. first video, the hapo no hapo no, came through. Right, the power so of hundred. Yeah. Yeah. It's it's and we are already crossing that. So today is going to be amazing for each one who's logged in right now. Trust me, it's going to be amazing for you. Even if you're just sitting here and listening, we are not really going to do, uh, you know, I'm not too much into a big meditation, but what I'm going to do for you guys is I'm going to do a healing. Yeah. In the last five minutes or maybe in between, let me see how it goes. And uh, 
just it's about manifestation so it's going to be amazing yeah and you know what i love we don't have a plan like me and him me and ashley <laughs> never have a plan we message each other today it is not yeah we'll talk okay we'll talk and that's okay I, so I, so I let's think... see what cards come up today yeah, yeah go on go on you're talking no that's i'm saying that that's i'm saying that we talk and he's like yeah okay we'll talk and it just flows right i don't know when that arg- and by the way now insta live doesn't cut you off at uh, 59 minutes it yeah, doesn't but, cut but me today off we, uh, today we're going to do 30 minutes okay i know but i'm just saying <laughs> just in case <laughs> yeah okay so yeah so let's see what's the message what we're going to start with today fucking oh, shit <laughs> this <laughs> okay uh, kids sorry i just said duck but look at this oh wow look at oh this my card. god manifestation of course yeah, it clearly says man and and this is what i love about the angel cards i mean they're like they're so bang on look at the intention and today's intention of what we're going to do is talk about manifestation now you know a lot of people keep asking me about what is this 1111 what is this 111 now we, of course you know i've already spoken in the yeah. angel uh, you know thing about the significance of it but what is all this about what is this consciousness what is the shift and change that's taking place so i i feel you know let's give out information to people who are probably new new to this you know absolutely so, absolutely so so get this straight you know we are living on earth which is called as a third dimension the right. 3d okay now in the third dimension we have time we have everything that's here it's what we call as a reality all right now in the third dimension like when we are a soul we take a birth on this on this plane which is a school uh, earth is called as a school this is where we go through our lessons and learnings right. and all of that right okay but you know what as we keep evolving like from the first standard we go to the second grade third grade 10th grade you know and then we keep going into a higher college this is what our school is all about yeah so it's our job right now you know that is what our soul plan is to shift to evolve ourselves yeah. and go to a higher plane of consciousness yeah and that is what we say moving from the third dimension to the fourth and the fifth dimension okay Correct. now what keep what keeps us locked into the third dimension is what we normally call as a drama trauma okay the the basic thing is you know the lower harmonics the yeah. fear the anger the jealousy you know and this is what it is all about that keeps us locked in here and that is where things like access consciousness you know empowers you to get out of the drama trauma you Correct. know there are spiritual courses you know which helps you get out of that you know the detachment nirvana and all of the things we talk about the eternal bliss and that Correct. is what i think you know uh, you guys would also speak about is consciousness you know i right. you know it's about awareness that you know how you can actually live a blissful life like Absolutely. most of the people think life is difficult life is a full of struggle and all of those things but it's not true yeah if we consciously make a shift life is really magical and that is what i keep talking about like this whole kedarna trip was so magical and i witnessed so many magical moments yeah. and that is where i keep talking about the trust with the universe yeah and this is a time when you have to start building that trust with the universe make it stronger now what has happening right now is if you understand in 2012 one sec i think my yeah uh, is this better it was fine i, okay. I could see so okay so if you understand in 2012 people were talking about the end of you know the world yeah. it was not en- it was not end of the world mm. it was the end of the mind calendar Correct. what predicted till 2012 but what actually the shift was the earth is spinning so fast it actually shifted its axis to a little degree yeah now what's happening is we have entered into a different era and that is what we call as the golden era you know which is the Correct. era of consciousness yeah so we all are stepping into a different dimension right now now with the dimension things are changing and that is why right. we are witnessing so many changes so in many. our lives yeah whether it is globally or whether it is personally if you see in the last 10 years there's been a lot of shift even when it comes to spirituality yeah right, when i started my when i started my journey you know people were not even aware of you know a lot of things like regressions past life and all of that but today thanks to the shift that is taking place like see how many people are actually witnessing 111 222 the vibrations everybody is able to see and feel right now okay and these are the times when each person can tap into this change of frequency and change your absolutely, life absolutely absolutely now we are we are always talking i'm always talking about 
vibrations and frequency and all of those things right we are energetic beings yeah. we are made of frequency and vibration that is why if you know me now by now i'm not religious i mean i yeah. i don't believe in religion i believe in every religion actually i don't Correct. confine myself only to say a hindu that's why if you see there's mother mary in my healing center you see everybody but it's not that i really believe in a religion but what i believe is in vibration what i believe yeah. is so for me when i went to kedarnath it was that vibration it was that frequency and believe me that is what it is all about so Absolutely. on earth so on earth there are different places yeah like our place like uh, himalayas yeah uh, in california there's mount shasta, shasta there because the ley lines yeah. because they are vibrating so because so the, the ley lines the, absolutely the ley lines even our, gold, there, even our golden temple but they've said the ley has they moved a little it's bit it shifted it shifted, shifted a bit yeah yes. Yes, perfect it's shifted. so there are there are this powerful ley lines on the earth which cross and that is where the vortex gets created in sedona in usa so our Absolutely. place you know in india you know if you haven't gone anywhere out but if you can get a chance these are the places where you can go like kedarnath um, you know uh, kailash and these are the places when you go there naturally it's... there is this energy shift that takes place Absolutely. yeah and you start thinking differently you start feeling differently you start looking at things differently and that is what you know now shiva we talk about is you know yeah. is consciousness, consciousness the third eye yeah exactly. it's about it's about looking at life from a completely different perspective and that is what consciousness is about yeah you become aware of how to handle things in your life you become aware of how to create things in your life yeah. you become aware of everything around you yeah and then nothing becomes like a drama trauma you're able to handle so yes today thankfully there are so many modalities tools that help us reach there you know like initially it used to only be meditations and right. how many people can really do meditations people who i meet they're like i can't even do 10 minutes of meditation so you just don't have to do meditation like you know it's like you have to reach a destination the journey for each person can be different yeah I, I, you can I've lost each you. person can you can you yeah uh, you're back can yeah, you see me now you're back you're me now okay so yeah so i was saying that you know each person can take their own journey to reach a level of consciousness and i always believe we all are conscious at different different level and there Correct. is no race in consciousness yeah we all only are on a path and a journey it's race. not like oh vibo is at a higher level of consciousness i am at a lower level of consciousness it's not that at all yeah it's it's a it's a journey that we are going through Okay, somebody saying my voice is breaking. It's, can you guys hear me now. clearly now? Now we can. Now I can. It was breaking in the middle. Okay. You're back. Okay, this is the first time I'm actually sitting in my healing center and doing a live. So I'm not sure about the network connection here. How it's good fine. it is. So it's fine. Yeah, it so was shaky in the middle, okay. but it's fine now. All right. So I was talking about this. Now what is happening is like today, eleven, eleven. Yeah? yeah. There are this. specific energy portals that open up open up yeah right. and when you when you tap into this energy it changes your frequency yeah now when we talk about the third dimension i mentioned about the fear it's all about money materialism you know how much money i have and the car that i have and all of that but as we start raising so that is where we get stuck in the lower chakras but right. as we start increasing our vibration we start looking at life from the higher perspective the third eye from the heart and from the third eye yeah so when you do this practices yeah it's it's how easily you can shift and change correct now to bring the shift and change there are of course various techniques right the practices that you do whether it is sound therapy listening or choosing those tools to make the change but today naturally i mean if you see the significance that you spoke about 11 11 on 2020 now look at all the significance a it's the end of a decade correct yeah yeah now to november is a month of a which i always talk about is abundance this year specifically okay it's about change yeah second thing is if you see 11 11 11 11 2020 20, if you add up it's 8 8 yeah? oh and and eight. that's and that's the number of abundance and infinity endlessness right. so if you actually tap into this energy you see the infiniteness that you can bring in your life 
Yeah, and rightly as you mentioned, you know that just two days later is Dantiras, and then is right. Diwali. Now you know the energy that's around us right Absolutely. now. It's about celebration. It's about happiness. It's about that exuberant abundance that we talk about, which is you know. So what if you could tap into that energy today and from today onwards? And take all it day? onwards. It, Absolutely. The, the the portal doesn't close in; it's opened. Now it's right. open. Now what happens is when eleven eleven portal opens up, the energy starts coming more closer to you. The spiritual energy, which is basically the spiritual dimension, the other dimension, which is where the ascended masters are. When I talk about ascended masters, whoever you believe in, you know whether it is Jesus or whether it is you know uh, uh, Krishna, or Krishna or Shiva or you know these are all the ascended masters. You know Sai Baba who have lived on this earth also. They come closer to us at the spirit level, you know, to right. bring a shift and change in our lives. Okay, then you have, of course, you know the angels, the archangels, and then beyond that, you know, when you go to the other dimension, there are the Palladials and Acturians, and from the whole other dimensions who are now coming closer to okay. us to help us elevate. So it's like we got to upgrade ourselves. We have to yeah. elevate ourselves to bring a shift and change in life. Now, you know, and that is what ascension is all about. ascending okay. ourselves and we are all going through this progress of ascension yeah process the process of ascension if i say this okay now if you must have seen the shift that is taking place from 2012 till now you know people are leaving their jobs and yeah. you know getting into something that they like to do or a relationship that's not working they're ending and new ones are beginning you know so that is what the shift and change is all about you know you you're going to step up you know you're not going to be a victim that, anymore and yeah you so know that is what is down with fear correct so there's no and and the moment you overcome all this and the moment you start so, overcoming all this lower harmonics you actually start living a blissful life yeah, yeah? and when when you a day will come when you actually work on yourself and if you work on yourself you'll actually tap into the fifth dimension now what will be the fifth dimension what we talk about is ease you won't have any worry no stress and life will just be magical and and that will truly happen now it's a time to happen now so when you're, you you know you'll get over your karma you'll get over all the past baggages that you're holding on to yeah so it is time to let go so 1111 is a portal that has opened it for you to clear all your past baggages it is helping you let go of the stuff and for you to manifest what manifest. you would like to have in your life correct yeah now every time we've spoken about this 1111 is a time for manifestation yeah so imagine today the whole day or tomorrow because you know what i mean time is it's not just india right for some people it started yesterday for some people it's going to start from tonight tomorrow. you know so the energies are there now also remember one thing yeah time is not real yeah yeah time is just the construct of our reality in the third dimension or in this world but if you actually step beyond time is just space and energy yeah so you can actually tap into this energy right now bring that energy within you now there's another beautiful thing because i work with so much of angels yeah 11 11 11 so 1 1 1 1 these are the four pillars of the archangels yeah so today you know when i'm going to do the healing for everybody who is there yeah they can ask for whatever they want in their mind whether it's finances whether it is you know a healing that they require a relationship healing that they require i'll work on them for 5 minutes but what i'm going to invoke is i'm going to invoke this four big archangels to surround us those are the four pillars that they will be working and then the interdimensional wow. beings will come so when i do this therapies you know when i work on people you know i don't touch them i just work energetically but i don't work these are the beings who actually work mm-hmm. and people who are visual they say you know ashish there was somebody was standing next to you yeah. and and ashish she was bummed. standing there <laughs> so and and it's all real so basically you know what start believing believe there is this whole external force believe that you are you know that the whole universe has your back believe that Absolutely. it's a time that whatever you're asking for is coming for you now please everybody who is there please keep this in mind yeah whatever you're asking should be something that's good for you yeah, yeah. please don't, good. don't it should you know be very that's consciousness yeah that's consciousness be conscious of what comes out of your mouth yeah be conscious of what you say Absolutely. what you are asking even if you practice that 
that itself is so amazing yeah don't never say what you don't want like i keep saying you no know, don't say i don't want to be sick yeah i don't want corona to get a <laughs> i loved it when i corona say corona <laughs> when <laughs> when you ask me doc are you mad you are really bad as a boy i said i know i'm mad but she's like kedarnath is corona i said what is corona <laughs> and trust corona me, because, corona let me tell you one thing viruses and any kind of bacteria and all they also have a vibration, vibration every absolutely every, I totally agree every with virus that. bacteria everything operates at a vibration now the, you will only attract if you are operating at the similar vibration now remember one thing these come to you when you have fear these come to you ashish no, it's fine. you are so no, stuck no. I, I'm I, never I, stuck. No. I'm very. He's, I was just going to say he's. I was just going to say he's never stuck. I'm the most unstuck. <laughs> so, I, mean, I yeah, just, so. just came in the front. I said I came back. I said I'm waiting for him to see this. So he said to me, "Stuck never. I flow. Yeah, yeah. with so, his and, joy." And, and that's what i want each person to be you know so flexible that they should just yeah. flow you know it's amazing how things starts flowing through you within you and you know what this is where we have to let go of everything that we hold on to every emotion and when you let go of all the emotions you just start flowing i'm telling you you have to have a very high level of trust with the universe and I, the leap I, of the, i completely <laughs> agree with you the leap of faith should be there and you know what and then you can create anything and everything in your life trust me it's so so amazing so I yeah surrender I mean, and knowing universe have your back are the two most powerful statements or point of views that you can have absolutely absolutely and you know believe me so when we talk about abundance i mean for me abundance is like the easiest thing like yeah. changing people's financial realities actually has been my forte because i feel it's just such an easy energy to change it's just first thing you that you have to change is your mindset and right. if your mindset changes automatically that you start seeing changes in your life you don't have to really do like see i, I you know i i shared that one small little tip last time you know the lemon and rice again okay? i know there are things that are external that can be very powerful that's supplementary Yeah, Correct. it can add on, but don't just you know depend on outside. What you have to do is you have to work on yourself. Mm-hmm. Yeah, mm-hmm. and that mindset, if you can change, abundance is yours, and and that is what I want you to start from today. Today is such a such a important day. Yeah, where you can make that choice today. That yes, I'm going to change my mindset from today. I'm absolutely an abundant mindset. Now, if you are an abundant mindset. this is what you got to start practicing every day yeah and believe me money is just pure energy it's just energy absolutely yeah and it will come to you it will come to you as long as you make the choice for it to come and this right. is where when we do this uh, classes you know which is uh, the whole access classes and all of that just in 4 hours you see how many people see those changes see, you know absolutely. so absolutely that that's why this month i scheduled my classes which is the money and also the bars and foundation because and of like, the energy why, because... why not tap into why not? this whole amazing energy G, while we change the mindset and energetically change everything for people so it's going to be super amazing i'm so excited for that yeah so anyway now you were asking me what are the things that we should do for dantiras okay yes now what do you do for dantiras i dress up and i go by i'm guju yeah i buy gold <laughs> <laughs> okay so But that's no, you know so for me i i find dantiras very significant because my name is after the the goddess right i keep telling you right the abundance <laughs> is always flowing because i mean money absolutely, absolutely. but uh, for so we i've always done this dressed up we do a whole diya lighting we do a poojas we have our you know our coins on which we do and hmm. we, my grandmother from the day i was born Had, she would even when I was born, she would take. She took me to buy the coins. So oh. that's our Dantera thing. So you tell us now what magic we can do this Dantera. So correct. So you you see how you you're so blessed. You're so lucky that you've been programmed for abundance from the time you were born. Yeah. yeah that's Absolutely. very very important you know so i always tell you know uh, you know people to tell their kids that you're so lucky you're so lucky for us and it's just that you know it's a mindset 
yeah believe me i mean you know from childhood i don't know why i have always thought that you know like lakshmi ji is always with me i love her because i love the way you know the jewelry you know i love the way you know coins come out of and I, like a child i used to be obsessed with all those things you know so you know i always feel that's true and believe yeah. me i always tell people you know like we say we have the you know masculine energy and the feminine energy right Correct. yeah and we talk about you know so you can have the power of shiva and you can have Shiv the power Shakti. of you know Shiv Shakti, and it's so Absolutely. strange, you know. So in Kedarnath, you know, it was all about Shiva and the power, and you know, and I'm obsessed with that energy also. And after that, everywhere that I've seen are pictures of Shiv Shakti together. Everywhere. Yeah. So two days back, I landed up seeing that movie Lakshmi also, which also had the about... whole energy of Shiv Shakti. You know, it was amazing. So I always say, yes, you know, I have the energy of Lakshmi. I have the energy of Kuber with me. And if you tap into that energy, you are that. i always say you know you know god is never outside yeah god is within you you are that you know you are god you are devi you are lakshmi you are everything don't separate that and when i say that i don't say that in ego yeah, yeah i don't mean to say absolutely that in ego not. i i say that with absolute humbleness that you are you are that you know so why would you suffer why would you have difficulties with money is just somewhere you're making that choice yeah you are creating that lack mindset and Correct. from today if you change that mindset and say no i am abundant and money will come to me and i know it's there yeah first you have to change your mindset yeah so as you mentioned you know so when it comes to diwali you know everybody is cleaning their house and you know dressing up well but i always say don't do that just for diwali that should be all the time look good feel good and that's why we talk about the feng shui of the house and feng shui of your own self right Correct. yeah so wear jewelry because that also has a vibration now Absolutely. people always people always say that oh we only wear jewelry like gold or something when we are going out for an occasion or something i say no always wear gold or something every day on your body why because gold has a acoustical vibration and a body also then starts becoming that vibration and believe me like attracts like and you start attracting abundance in your life now we are talking this only through energetic ways okay and this is where i'd say you know what don't think that you don't have i'm sure like i know i don't know whether i spoke to you about this girl one day she came to me and she says no i don't have money i don't have anything with me and all i said you know what when you go home tomorrow she had come for a class i said when you go home tomorrow open up your wardrobe remove everything that you have the jewelry that you have and your best clothes that I you have it. okay wear it okay wear it look into the mirror and say and say what energy you feel and she like yeah. the next day she called me she said i felt so good and then she put money whatever money she had in a wallet and she says no i have money and within the next few hours she got calls from clients who wanted to come to her for a few things you know so basically you're just attracting it I, so what i you, completely believe in that i completely you, believe in that so money is something that please don't run behind you have to attract money to you and you can change that by changing your frequency and vibration now this dhanteras you know because the dhanteras is about bringing an money you know, money money <laughs> yeah but for me you know what dhan also means not only just money abundance is abundance happiness and joy I, I yeah compare. totally wherever you are joyful wherever you are happy money just follows like believe me i never work for money i don't do these things for money but i love the way you know people say money is a by product money yeah. is always a by product of what we choose and that is what so first thing as vibe uh, we mentioned you know dress up well look good feel good and all of that yes please go and buy something that day even yeah. if you have little money buy small yeah whether it's a 1 gram or a 5 gram i always buy gold i always yeah. buy gold on 1st of january i mean i don't need reasons but yes on my birthday <laughs> on dhanteras i don't need reason i'm a gujju <laughs> <laughs> i think i'm born gujju <laughs> okay but you know what it's it's about you know what attracting now you know what you may not have a lot even if you don't have a lot of money just go and buy a small little thing yeah buy a small little thing and when you buy that hold it in your hand and be grateful thank yeah. you you know thank you for coming in my coming life in. and and ask you know what will it take for more to follow you know because everything has consciousness everything that you speak to it has vibration and consciousness and ask for more and more to follow all right so yes you know you can buy gold you can buy silver you can buy 
a vessel if you want and that is something i feel a lot of people do but you must do this yeah so your relationship with money has to change by doing the small little steps okay now there are two important things i'm going to share and then we'll talk about how to tap into this frequency okay on dhanteras remember one thing when you do the puja in the evening okay light 13 13 13 dias in the house and 13 dias outside the house remember this okay that's it okay just do this yeah right 13 dias in the house 13 dias outside, outside the house okay don't ask me why magicians never tell the secret I, okay i was never going to ask you why <laughs> okay in 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 the evening yeah open up the doors yeah keep your doors open you know let your house well every day not only during diwali yeah you know i i go to people's house and they hardly light their houses why bijli bachana <laughs> i said but you know light the house the money will come that you can pay the electricity don't worry about that but your house should always be well lit welcoming yeah? but absolutely welcoming so when you're putting this diyas okay there is a specific reason why i said 13 and 13 small small one a uh, one three one three I'm mentioning tera mera tera 30 <laughs> okay not 30 yeah and just place inside and outside 13 13 remember that and do that the second thing is this is you everybody can do this but especially for people who are struggling with money especially for people who are going through a lot of financial difficulties okay now now listen to this carefully when i say this okay uh, we uh, i don't know what's it called in hindi but we call clouds clouds uh lavang lavang okay you got to take two lavang all right just two lavang but make sure they are whole in terms mm. of you know they have the top, the top. and yes. and the prongs you know the four yeah. prongs like the diamond ring prongs okay so take two whole lavang okay clean it properly wash it properly dry it and uh, i don't know uh, what's it called uh, there's a sugar uh, patasha which we use in holi remember that uh, sugar ka, uh, no it, it's like that uh, coin thing the sugar coins you know uh, patasha kehte hai i don't know what it's called in english okay, okay. but if you if you don't you know in holi they offer in uh, puja they offer it's a sugar thing anyway i'll post it on uh, tomorrow yeah. i'll post it on the story so you all see that okay patasi patasi uh, yeah that's that's Batasha. the one okay okay patasa patasa okay so just take one of it okay and okay, please so long two... in hindi lavang is gujarati so yeah, long in yeah. hindi Huh. Yeah. So put those two gloves on it, okay? okay, and offer it to Lakshmi on Dantheras, okay? okay. Now, if you don't get that patasha, okay, what you can do is take a small little uh, sugar, a, a, a spoon of sugar, place those two, and offer it to Lakshmi on uh, Dantheras day, okay? Now, when you do this. just pray just pray that infinite abundance comes to your house now if you are watching this and you know of course i am also sending those energies that you require to bring the change in your life okay tell me after 6 months tell me within a year if money has not started showing up okay but also remember one thing your mindset is very yeah. very important okay now what i want you to do is this is an offering that you do okay uh, by diwali you'll remove it otherwise ants will come and haunt your house okay <laughs> it's common sense okay what you do is you know with the puja ka thing you know just uh, remove it but every day every day when you wake up in the morning whether you go in front of your temple if you have a temple or jesus or whatever and just first thing i want you to say is thank you for everything that i have in my life yeah i want you to do this your mindset has to change okay. thank you for everything that i have that you have given me and i know more is coming my way yeah you have to open up your receiving you have to wow. open up your receiving yeah every time the second thing is every time you see a person you know with a rich you know like a car you know a bmw or you hear someone making a lot of money and if you're struggling through it you know and you're not able to i want you to start saying bless you Mm. yeah bless that person bless you bless you because you know what it's so you know immediately you know mere paas nahi hai bas iske paas ho raha hai you know ye log paise chhap rahe hain mere paas nahi ho raha the the um, the moment you get into that mode you stop the money energy flowing to you 
yeah so i want you to from today yeah start being happy for everybody else's success bless you bless you yeah and you will open up your doorways do yeah. this from today itself because believe me it's very important that you change the way you think the change the way you are being in your life and if you just start shifting and changing the way you are you start being happy Absolutely. yeah believe me you know i meet a lot of people and they keep saying you know what oh when i have the money i'll be happy oh money is going to solve my problems money is never going to do that it's your mindset because uh, if you're unhappy today when you have a lot of money tomorrow you're still going to be unhappy still going like to be you might be more I, unhappy and you'll be more stressed <laughs> oh my god what are the money goals i i so <laughs> agree with this lot of it you know what trust me happiness is a state of joy it's a choice it's a state of your mind yeah. you can be happy with money you can be happy without money without. it doesn't matter but yes i mean who wouldn't like money i love money i mean money just gives you that whole choice to choose what you want to do whenever you want to do right yeah the luxuries like that day i had this lady who came to me and she's like you know what ashish i really want to get into healings and all but i don't want to give up my luxuries i said why do you have to give up your luxuries i love a luxurious life i love my life i love my but you know what it's that's not what you run behind yeah yeah so when you start become more conscious more spiritual it's going to be more of a contribution outside and that happiness that you have believe me it's amazing it is just flow, amazing right like how you just flow it it absolutely it, it does nothing requires effort it doesn't it doesn't nothing. feel like you're doing work it doesn't feel like it's an effort work travel is just like you know it's so magical i'm telling you i'll share a quick thing with you so we went to kedarnath okay my my plan was very free flowing but i had very little few days you know three days in and go do the darshan and leave the same day next day take a flight you know because i had to come, come back for few things you know so so this guy said okay you know in the night you have to stay in rishikesh i'm like okay but i had not booked a hotel in rishikesh because we didn't know how the travel would be so when i started so i went online and i did a booking and and then what happened it was so funny we uh, the booking on uh, you know uh, make my trip you know i got a confirmation and all of that at night around 9 9:30 because that place goes kind of dead around that time yes. it's a small place you know so 9 9:30 i reached the hotel and they said that you know what i'm sorry but you know we all sold out i said how is that possible because i have a confirmed booking how is that going to be possible you know and then these guys said don't worry you know and they gave me such a beautiful place just 2 minutes away and it was actually a you know the ganga i mean uh, you know they say sing the river and all of that i mean everything is just taken care of but anyways but the other other magical thing that happened is when we reached kedarnath before kedarnath you have to go to the small village and there also i had no booking because everybody told me go there and do it now we went to this place and he showed me one small little room and it was so bad energy wise i said no i can't sleep here even if we have to just leave at 5 or 6 in the morning i can't stay here i need to have a good energy room you know so then he says no no go wherever so then i called somewhere else and they and there they also have the tent like camps it's yeah. so cold you can't stay in a tent camp i can't stay for sure i know? stay in tent camp freezing in december and jump into the ganga i i i didn't want to do that for sure yeah not ready for that yet okay so then i called this guy and then he says yeah yeah we have this uh, luxurious places and all of that and he was like 6 8 grand for a night now that didn't make sense to me because i'm just going to go in sleep and get out in the morning so i said okay let's go you know i said so i'm in a google map pe dala and google started taking me there and suddenly i'm seeing it's taking me to another place i'm like hello and i can clearly visibly see it's taking me to a longer route i said ye kya hai mujhe guma kyu rahi hai ye you know google so it was so funny then you know from 8 minute it became 26 minutes i'm like that's really crazy you know so the driver was getting a little pissed you know because he, i'm taking him there taking you so i yeah, said right. listen I just did one thing. I said, "Listen, angels, please take care of us. Yeah, I don't know where we are right now, and make sure you take us to a place where you know it it suits us. You know, I just said this, and I said, you know, Kedarnath ji, I'm coming to you. You got to take care of me. You know, this is how I speak. You know, and believe me, in five minutes, the driver said, 'Ki bhaiya, मैं आपको एक दूसरी जगह दिखा बोल भी आपको चलेगा क्या? So दिखाओ क्या है? The first place he took us." Was so beautiful, yeah. So I said, okay, let's go and ask him. The place was available. The food was amazing, and they charged us like three grand, which is nothing compared to what this guy said. So I was like, if the if Google wouldn't have taken us to this longer road, we would have gone there, right? Now this is where I say trust. 
Yeah. That small little I told Rahul I say this is magic for me. You know, this these small small things are my and what a beautiful place we actually stayed in, yeah. And the next day when we were returning we went to Rishikesh we were supposed to fly the very next day but I saw the energy of the player as a listen let's cancel tomorrow's tickets. <laughs> cancel tomorrow's tickets let's take the next day of flight and we stayed back one day, you know. But that is what it is, you know, out of the box trusting the universe everything is taken care of and the magic that i've seen there is amazing now each person here can actually witness magic yeah but please please start trusting things you yeah, have the leap take the leap of faith but most important is the universe has your back your please back. change your mindset your mindset is the most important thing and that is what i feel you know whenever you guys get a chance do access consciousness and learn the tools it has changed my life so much in the last 8 years you know i don't want to come to the point where i feel like i'm selling a class but that is consciousness i mean you know yeah. your life will never be the same again it's so so amazing and then what will happen is you'll only keep opening doors for different different possibilities like you will never get stuck in life yeah. and that is what you have to be like water you know you just have to free flow and life is so so beautiful i can't tell you so yeah so i'm very happy that we all are here and uh, what i want to do for you guys vibhavi do you have any questions i have i have no questions <laughs> I don't I I never have questions with you. I only will tell you stuff. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's see what's coming up. Do you want to The next card them? came is the next card came is transformation. Oh. And remember one thing, November and this year is the year of transformation. You've seen what Absolutely. we have gone through. Yeah, Absolutely. the whole Corona thing. It's here to transform us. It's here to change us. And please, you know, transform your lives. Don't live the normal, regular life. You've not come here to suffer. You have not come here to go through difficulties. You have not come here to have diseases. Please, and it doesn't happen to you. Yeah. You know, when people say, "Ye mere saath ho raha hai." Oh. No, no, no! Nothing happens to you. You are just making a choice unknowingly, and you all can make a choice to have such a fabulous life. So please do that. It's amazing. I can't keep telling how amazing life is. I keep saying that again and again. But truly, I mean, so yeah. So take this time. We are entering into a whole new decade now, twenty twenty one. But you know what? I mean, if you don't change, it, you might. I still go through the same difficulties and the same shit that everybody else is going. You have to wake yeah. up now and enter into the fourth and the fifth dimension. It's not only meditation that can help you. Read books. There's so much amazing stuff out there. You know, there are so many things now that will help you evolve. And each person is different. Everybody here is different. Remember that we all are not the same. So yeah. you pick up your route. Yeah, how you want to go, but just. just change your life it's so so important yeah and i know each person here is fabulous and you will so yes this year is going to be now for you to transform your life and whatever step that is required please take that yes why bubi i'm just reading the messages it's insane there i mean i know he's he is amazing at that i told you guys uh, should we should we what do you are we doing oh This is for who? Now remember, your guard. Everybody. Guardian angels. I always keep saying your guardian angels are always, always there with you. Please, please, please remember that you are never alone. Yeah. yeah. I always tell people, you know, don't mess up with me because you don't know who's standing behind me. Um, <laughs> yeah. Forget me. My, my son tells them. <laughs> You don't know my mama. She has all these people. <laughs> She'll send them to you when you're asleep. We have the whole force standing behind you. Yeah, and trust me, that's the whole aspect of it. You know, so please, you know, you're not the victims. Transform your life. You're not the victim of financial difficulties. You're not the victim of relationship. It's time for each person to wake up. So yes, manifestation. You can manifest the life that you would like to. transform your life and you're not alone these are the three big messages that are there for each one that is there listening to us today yeah all right we have 200 people let's do some magic for everybody i said we'll i'll talk for 30 minutes but i've spoken for 45 that's minutes I, that's, did you, did you, that's did me you my, did, you, did you see my laugh <laughs> when you said no 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 yeah, 20 minutes <laughs> 
<laughs> all right okay so what i want each person to do is what i'm going to do is i'm going to tap into i'm not going to take you through a, a meditation yeah i'm going to enter into the state where i'm going to be the channel for you i'm going to tap into the different frequencies that are already here trust me because you know i, I do i do trans mediumship i i work with spirits and they're already here so excited to work with you guys now you all may be in different parts of the world it doesn't matter energetically because for the rem there is no time and there is no distance yeah mm-hmm. so right now we all are together right now we all are here in the same plane wherever you are right now what i want you to do is i want you all to think about something that you truly truly desire something that you will really like to manifest today is a very powerful day right now we are sitting at a very very powerful time vortex yeah so what is it that you would like to change what is it that you would like to create what is it that you would like to have in your life yeah anything i see someone going through certain disease yeah i'm going to change that for you we will work on that yeah all the small small financial difficulties trust me it's going to change don't worry about that also yeah all right what i want each person to do is just sit quietly wherever you are take a nice deep breath in breathe out one more deep breath in and breathe out and one more deep breath in and breathe out just relax i want you to put an intention that i'm open to receive and receiving everything right now that will change my life forever i want you to perceive this energy there are four strong archangels the four corners where you are right now archangel michael raphael uriel and gabriel the four strong pillars there for you on your left right behind and i want you to imagine this beautiful white light it's like a doorway a portal that enters and the frequency is coming through you entering into your crown chakra now i want you to sense the tingling sensation the vibration the heat the cold and as i say this i see them working on the heart area of somebody somebody's knee is being worked on right now the limitation blockages 11 11 is an important time where all your old patterns your old beliefs you're going to let go of and you're shifting to a higher level of consciousness perceive the energy that's coming to you and those who cannot sense some wondering is it really happening trust is this about your perceiving tapping into the abundance that's always there for you say yes to the abundance that's coming to you and you are abundant and you're opening up to the infinite flow of abundance that's always going to be yours opening up to the expected unexpected ways the things are going to show up in your life for your highest good and giving up the programs of suffering comes of harsh the welcoming the ease and joy in your life i see few people getting into a new relationship i see those people who are single this is a time when you're going to attract new people in your life welcome them do not judge them before they come into your life open open up your receiving the one who's asking for a relationship is definitely going to get one the one who's already in a relationship it's going to get stronger this year
you can choose to get out of this whole drama trauma of life you got to choose that ease and it's yours so be it so be it so be it expect miracles in your life my dear ones and everybody come back in the here and now and open your eyes okay magical <sighs> i can't say what went through i can't say what i saw there's a whole lot of things that i saw but i just want people to now know trust have the trust and faith mm-hmm. do the small small little things i i'm not i'm not too much into rituals do the small small little things that i shared with you all okay watch this over again but tell me you know get back to me tell me what's changing what's shifting why baby always sends me you know uh, screenshot that and screenshot <laughs> <laughs> and uh, i know i know this you know what i knew this that's why today i was sitting in this healing center because the energy is already so strong here the moment i sat i could feel the buzzing around me instantly yeah it's like so high on energy like you you see, you know you've seen the healing center like right, right now even this two big power this two big powerful acs are on yeah normally everybody's chilling in this room i'm sweating now yeah, the so sweat is basically the sweat is energy the energy that tra- transmits through me to each person and let me tell you each person here is really 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 blessed yeah because you made the choice to come here yeah, yeah? you made the cho- that choice is important and that's how you receive it you receive it you know not like the lazy ones who oh, I'll see it later and then I was <laughs> no offense to them also <laughs> they are last year when yeah. i'm here next time <laughs> i love you guys i love to see you guys and you know what honestly i mean web is like come come let's do i'm like web let's do next week and i'm like but I'm you know like, no, i'm no. like that <laughs> I, don't, i don't say no to me <laughs> I, I, i never say no it. to you yeah. you know i've I had think... so many people who asked me before to come and do lives i'm like yeah yeah i'll do i'll do i'll do but you have never said no i don't know why but i get always a lot of people telling me that they love your vibe and my my vibe together it's just like and okay so i'm going to say honestly like the way you handle me is amazing <laughs> <laughs> that's a really cool poster <laughs> no they that say they say that you know the way she handles you is amazing she just she just lets you be you know i mean you know you're not like typically talking in between and interrupting and all of that and you know you once i start I... <laughs> we like you said man talk for 20 minutes that's why i said hmm, i laughed like that i said hmm. <laughs> again the second time the guardian angel has popped up so so strong because they're all around i can't believe it yeah. they're it's, full it's... full present okay. it's funny i spoke about union yeah there are people who are going to get united there are people who are going to create new relationship there are people so those people who are single i'm sorry to say you won't be single for too long <laughs> so enjoy the fuck of it <laughs> fun. relationship is supposed to be so beautiful and you're just supposed to and raise your vibration oh, wow raise 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 your vibration i think That's you've done it. i think you've done that for all the 207 people who are on right we now. are we my are my hands are sweating my palms are yeah. sweating okay so remember what you have received is like a whole energy boost right now even if you yeah. don't understand it yeah it's it's like this whole surge of energy that's come to you now i want you to just do one thing focus on being positive in life the things that i told you about be aware of what you say and have fun and remember one thing money follows where there's joy yes yeah money follows where there's joy be happy all the time yeah find reasons to be happy yeah because if you find reasons to crib and cry you're going back into the lower vibration so you know just enjoy this you know this life that you have starting from today yeah swear on me that you're going to have fun and it's going to be a fabulous year let people suffer it's their choice you know i mean yeah. but it's important what you do for yourself yeah you look at your own life and that's the most important thing so happy 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 diwali to each one of you have a fabulous time 
send me your pictures all dressed up looking gorgeous looking good we should we should do a diwali hop you don't know what that is the like you can keep changing people and they keep coming out and show this stuff go out the next person yeah? it's called it's called the live hop i don't even know see i don't even know half the things that happens in this world like that day i was talking to someone i said listen i don't know taxing i don't know anything about this reality <laughs> talk talk about energy and creation i'll create whatever you want because you're flowing But, like water no people are flowing with you don't worry about it so i don't understand anything about this reality actually i'm such a goner now <laughs> so yeah so uh, coming by happy diwali to each one of you have a fabulous time spend time with your family and uh, love everybody that's around and a lot of love from my side to each one of you and especially to you <laughs> thank you thank you vaibhavi you are fabulous and uh, yeah i just love Listen, being with you here thank you for doing this thank you for making me message you and call you five times to say we have to do this thank you for being so selfless Most... and coming on and you know i think lifting everyone up with your amazing energy and your smile and you know you you embody ease and joy so you know it's not yeah. it's not hard for people to believe or even accept that they can to be like that you know it's everyone it's can be happy if <laughs> uh, once i, I think this think corona like goes away once i think this corona goes away i i wish we all can meet live oh yeah man, in person everybody who is here everybody who is here that'd be amazing that'd be amazing. So amazing to see you guys and yeah we'll have fun all right so happy diwali guys thank you so much for logging in and I, i this was magical i'm sure and uh, please write to me and to dr ashish because he loves hearing back from you uh please write to him directly <laughs> And don't tell me <laughs> that he is not replying back. <laughs> But remember, Dante, just do those two things, okay? And yes. go and buy something. Yes. And yeah. should we? Should they do? Listen to this again at eleven eleven at night. Your last part, or it's done. Ah, uh, if if they can, yeah, they can. I mean, you know, there's always more that they receive because you know what? Even if people are going to li- listen to this tomorrow, like you know, the lemon thing that day was Friday, and I said, okay, do it tomorrow and all. A lot of people messaged me. Oh, I'm seeing it Saturday. now. Can I do it? I said, do yeah. it. I said, just do it. You know, and. they have seen immediate results within two days three days time you know so yeah so what the energy that work we do is timeless now today is when the portals open they're not going to shut Correct. off so even if you was this again tomorrow day after a month three months later the vibrations are still going to reach you yeah and that's what i love about energy you cannot come can find energy it's always there for you yeah so yes you can see this again you can watch it again and get the energies again and yeah share it with people if they like to change their life it's up to them yeah all right thank you so much <laughs> thank you so much happy diwali happy dhanteras and have a magical 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 night guys see you. you bye, bye. <laughs> take care bye bye see ya hey guys uh, thank you for logging into live with vai uh, subscribe to see more videos